Hi all, Dan here with your latest Summit and Whiskey Club ramblings. Hopefully you've recently received an email from us. This is confirming your April delivery. Please can I ask you to check both your delivery address and that you're getting the bottle you expect. Um, our system, whenever there's a payment failure, can set up a new membership as opposed to continuing the existing membership. So we just need to make sure that everyone who's expecting to get this new special bottle that no one knows about is, and all new members are getting the Glasgow exclusive that we shared in December. So please check that email, and if there are any changes, please do that by 6pm Sunday, because that's when we're downloading our lists to share with the warehouse. Uh, and away from that, the last couple of weeks have been quite fun. I spent a big chunk of it um, with a distillery that we will be importing later this year, beginning of next year. Um, because you may remember that I've been struggling to get hold of international brands. Uh, and I'm trying many different ways and this is one way we're going to do it. They're doing something very unique, something different. Uh, their whole process from the grain they use to how they store their whiskey is unique. And I am very, very happy to uh, be the ones that will be importing it into the UK. Their, their capacity, the amount that they release in a year is, is tiny. Um, so for us to be able to get hold of it is fantastic. But that is something we'll find out more about later in the year. Hopefully anyone who's ordered their McMira DLX bottles have now received theirs. Uh, as of this weekend, the Glasgow 1770 will go up to its normal retail price of 59.95. Anyone who wants that bottle, order it this weekend and you can still get it for the £50 that new members are getting it for. Uh, but then we've got to go up to the price where it actually covers its cost after that. Um, there is more. I'm trying to think what, what else has been going on. It's just been slowly organising the festival. We've got Tomatin now joining us as well as Firkin and the number of other international English and Scotch whisky brands. So looking forward to that. We started organising our virtual festival on 19th of November. We've got a few brands interested. Trying to see if I can do a uh, what I call a Hail Mary play. Uh, bringing one company in to supply every single brand. That would save me a hell of a lot of effort and we'll get a deep dive into uh, everything that they do. But we'll see what comes of it. Um, we're trying a number of different methods to get the brands involved so we can run this virtual festival as well because that is my aim going forward. We run one physical, one virtual every year because we can't get everyone together in St Albans. I understand that, but virtually we can. We can get every single member into the, into the room and enjoying it. So that, that's what I'm working on at the moment sorting out the bottles for the rest of the year we've got hopefully august agreed to signing off june this coming week october has pretty much been agreed and i'm working on december um, so yeah everything's nicely coming together uh, and being worked on in the background so i've been quiet the last couple of weeks just been a bit busy anyway have great whiskey and i'll chat to you soon